Congratulations on securing a position with Agri-Labor Australia for GrainCorp's Grain Harvest. This video is designed to help you gain a better understanding of what's involved in the harvest, allowing you to successfully face any challenges. Once grain crops have matured, the grain is harvested. Farmers load the harvested grain onto trucks, which then transports the load to the local grain corp site. All trucks are tested on arrival to determine the quality of the grain they are carrying. This is referred to as sampling. Once tested, the truck is weighed at the weigh bridge. The purpose of the weigh bridge stage is to determine how much grain the truck is carrying. Next, the truck drives to a bunker or silo to unload the grain. To ensure correct positioning, the truck is directed by an employee. When the truck stops, the truck driver will open the back of the truck to allow the grain to flow into the hopper. This transports the grain onto the top of the bunker. This process is extremely dusty, and people who suffer allergies to dust should not be located at the bunker. Grain can also be unloaded into a silo. Silos are large cement towers that store large amounts of grain, protecting it from a variety of environmental conditions. The process is like the bunker unload, with the truck being directed by the silo operator. This is the complete storage process. Once the harvest is completed, the outloading process begins. Here you can see footage of a silo operator filling a truck with grain that has been purchased by a client. It is now ready for transportation. By watching this video, you now have the required introductory knowledge to know what to expect when you arrive on site. GrainCorp will provide you with complete training prior to your start. To ensure that you are ready to complete the harvest successfully, there is some other important information you will need to know. It is important to understand the weather dependency of the harvest nobody can predict your start date. Grain Corp is relying on the farmers to begin their harvest, and to begin harvesting, farmers are relying on the weather to ensure appropriate growth of their crop. While AgriLabor Australia will continually provide you with updates regarding anticipated start dates, your patience and flexibility will be required. It is also important to understand the working conditions you will face. Grain corp sites are hot and dusty, with temperatures regularly above 30 degrees and often as high as 40 degrees. During the peak of harvest, you will be required to work long days, averaging between 8 to 14 hours. There are several tasks you must complete prior to commencing work on a grain corp site. These include completing the grain corp talent safety assessment and the grain corp online training modules. Please be mindful that these are two separate inductions and both must be completed. While you're on site, you must wear steel-capped safety boots with shoelaces, just like the pair of shoes shown here. You must bring a large 5-litre water bottle to take with you to work. Finally, you will need to wear a high-vis shirt and some work shorts or pants, as demonstrated here. For your comfort, we recommend purchasing a fly net to wear over your helmet. A hard hat, dust mask and safety glasses will be provided by GrainCorp. GrainCorp sites have kitchen facilities where you can store and prepare food for lunch. Please note that there are often no shops to access food nearby. A limited number of sites also have living quarters where you can live while you work. Please be aware that living quarters are not available at all sites. You must be prepared to source your own accommodation. 
Your recruiter would have discussed with you that there is a compulsory pre-employment drug and alcohol test. You must successfully complete this prior to commencing work at Grain Corp. Should you have any concerns about passing this test, please speak with your recruiter. Honesty is the best approach in this situation. And finally, given that the harvest is solely dependent on the farmer's crops, please ensure that you remain flexible and appreciate the variability of the harvest as stressed in this video. Some sites' harvests can go for as short as 10 days, where other sites can go for six weeks. AgriLabor Australia and Grain Corp cannot predict the duration of harvests. For those candidates who perform well but only receive a short working opportunity, AgriLabor Australia will endeavour to find you further work. Once again, congratulations on securing a position this year. We hope you enjoy the challenge ahead and the money to be made from completing a grain harvest. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact your recruiter.